Yo guys, what is up? Radical Will here, and today we are back with Retro Bowl. And, uh, yeah. So, we are the Arizona Cardinals, and we're not in a great spot right now. Started the season strong 2-0, but now, as you can see, looking at the standings, we are falling behind third in the division to uh, the Rams and of course the 49ers nobody cares about seattle right now it's not what we're talking about so we need to go out there and win some games right now it's the bye week so all right we got a trade offer to start off new orleans is offering offensive lineman young Kongbo. i don't know if i'm pronouncing that right as a trade in return they want a round two pick in the next season's draft so you know we gotta check this guy out oh yeah yeah, yeah. we're signing this guy yeah okay definitely dude that guy's stacked all right. Oh, he's 35. You know, it doesn't matter. All right, so let's go and play Tennessee. We can simulate the game, but we're not going to. So we can pick our alternate universe, uniforms and all that. Home. They're not home. They can get their alternate. You know what? They can do their, uh, their away. Got to do ball one, though. Okay, play. All right, let's get ready. Kick off. Here at home in Arizona, sweet home Arizona, a place I do not want to go to after this year's NLCS because I'm a Phillies fan, and that really saddened me that, okay, he caught it out of bounds. It really saddened me that a team so bad the previous year, oh, he caught it! Save that for later. What the heck was that play? Dude, I need to see the replay. All right, he, quarterback throws the ball. I couldn't even tell who had the ball. That was actually pretty crazy. Darn, that was... That was actually really cool. All right, I'll just throw that. All right, you got to catch that by this point, man. I mean, you know me. I'm not going to give you a good pass unless you catch the last one, so. Okay, third and five, and by this point. Okay, seven yards. Good. Third, okay, first and ten. He caught it again. Getting better, guys. Just throw to this one guy. Oh, oh! Could it be? You got to be joking. All right. Let's try this again. Let's go. Touchdown. G. Jackson. All right. I wonder how Coach thinks we're doing right now. All right. Let's take a little replay look at that. All right. One or two point conversion. Mm. Is it realistic to do a two point conversion right now? Oh, I don't did it. Let's go. Just look at him freezing there. All right. So, yeah, like I was saying, in the NLCS, Phillies took a 2-0 lead. Two wins away. Quarterback is sacked. Let's go. Lose in seven games. It was disappointing, but they'll win next year. And we've got another touchdown right in the book. Right in the book. 13 nothing. And I'm gonna, I probably should have gone for two points right there, actually. I doinked it. Didn't go in. All right, so 21 seconds left, all right. Incomplete Tennessee punts end of the first quarter. Arizona in their own half. That's a good return. Arizona has possession. No, I have possession. I am Arizona. Bro, get off my tails. All right, we're getting closer. We're getting closer. I feel it. He caught the ball. He caught the ball. It's a touchdown. Let's go. This is where I'd be doing the gritty. But I'm not the one who scored a touchdown. I used to play football in my elementary school. We didn't have, like, a team or anything. We just played, like, touch football at our playground. He caught it. Scored 21. Nothing. 
Uh, I had I do remember my career stats. Only my touchdowns. I scored five career touchdowns there at my school. One of them was never counted, but I was told by one of the kids that it was a touchdown. Touchdown. So yeah, five for my career. Not bad for a kid who didn't even know the NFL existed. Well, to be honest, you don't need to know that the NFL existed to be good at football. I wasn't good, though. That was like five touchdowns in a lot of games, let me tell you. Then I brought a wiffle ball bat, and I was done with it. Like, I never played ever again. And now my new school, I try playing football, but I don't get any passes. Because I now I'm in middle school. Let's go. All right, field goal. I gotta stop talking about my life story in football. If I miss this, I swear. Somebody's gonna unsubscribe because of that. It better not be you. First half over. All right, 21 nothing. This is where I'd start laughing, but I learned a lesson in sports. When it seems impossible to, please skip to uh, a few minutes. You don't wanna hear this boring lecture. When it seems impossible, there's always a way to persevere. William Rad. All right, he caught the ball. Oh, he's gonna go for the end zone. Cause if you didn't, you'd be kind of weird. Okay, that was not a good move. So we've got, what, 30 seconds left practically? Throw that up there. Catch that, no, no, don't catch that, don't catch that. Can I get, just go classic and pass to my running back? Two yards, people! Stiff arm. All right, this is going to be a tough play. Oh! He missed the tackle! Did that just happen? Did that just happen? Two-point conversion. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it today. I shouldn't have done that. Passing play. End of the third quarter. And guess what? We're up by 20, folks. Whether you like it or not. All right. Tennessee punts. Arizona on their own 22. That's a good return. Arizona in their own half. I'm going to be referring to Arizona as Arizona for the rest of this. All right. So Arizona is up by 20. God. All right. I'm going to do something I haven't done in a long time. Pass down. You can get in the habit of doing that. All right, fourth down, and uh, I caught the ball. I'm not going out of bounds. What, what did I just do right there? That was disgusting. All right. Throw the ball. Oh, I thought that was going to be intercepted. Glad it wasn't, but guess what? You should have caught that. All right, squeeze right through the hole here. Ooh. That, sorry, two things. I did not make it sound like it should have, and I didn't get to squeeze through the hole right there. All right. Okay. We've got our first interception of the episode. Every time that I throw the ball and it gets intercepted, you guys have to, have to watch the video even more. Let's go, we won. All right, pass for 300 yards in a game. Achievement obtained. The 49ers are seven and zero. What world do I live in? We are in the wild card though. And we are second in the division. We are the teacher's pet. And the teacher is Ari San Francisco. Let me retry that. We are the teacher's pet and the teacher is San Francisco. But soon enough, the pet will bite. The dog will bite. Or in this case, the cardinal will bite. If you had a cardinal that bit, you have a problem. All right, press interview. Offensive lineman Dion Kongbo, the guy I, oh, I just acquired him. Had a great game today. Well, that's good. The fans clearly want him to do well. Okay, his morale looks very bad, so I'm just gonna go praise him. Now he's happy. Our team condition is 91% through week seven, which is good. 
I'm gonna upgrade G Jackson. Grunky. Alright, so let's max out that speed. He is the fastest he'll ever be in his life. Got Coach Epps, 55 years old, doesn't have a trait. What kind of personality do you have? You're so boring. Name is Divine Epps. Okay, he's not that boring. He's got a middling first name. All right. News. The trade deadline is this week. All right. From next week on, you will, you, will, you will only be able to cut players from the team, not trade them away until next season. You will still be able to hire play, players from the free agent list. I can tell you guys about this, but Boston's off our team. Yeah. Got Coney Island, G. Jackson, Coach Coach, uh, Kong Boy, Green, Tolliver. I can't do anything with the name Tamu, though. I can't find anything. Curtin Certain and uh, Lowry. Okay, so should I trade? I don't know. What, what happens if I rest? I don't know. There's still a lot of things in this game I don't know. But it's only week eight and we can't trade anymore. Like in real life, it's week 15. It's been a while. All right, we got Dilemma. So, the owner wants to discuss future plans with you. You were intending to hold a meeting with your coaching staff. See, I do the meeting with my coaching staff if that was Coach Coach getting a morale boost, but it's not Coach Coach. So, we're going to meet the owner, get the uh, kudos, coaching credits, and now we're playing Philadelphia. This is a city I like, but it's not a football team I like. I'm a Giants fan. So we are about to crush this team, not make the city sad, and get to eat pizza, and not get kicked out like the Houston Astros did. All right, but today we're gonna do it a little differently. Lucky ball number five. This is gonna be the craziest game ever. Oh, it's raining. It's raining in Philly. Not good. Our green was too slow. All right, probably have to trade you next week. Oh, God. What was I doing? I should have been trading this. Oh, God. Oh, my God. The ball looks cursed. This is crazy. Oh, my God. It's hard to see. It looks like a normal football right now. But, okay, 19 yards. Not bad. Not bad. All right. He caught it! Oh, that was nice. Beautiful. Music? Music to my ears. And the music to my ears sounds like this. God, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, my God. That, that's got to be the dumbest thing ever. Like, I would not mind if you unsubscribe just because I did that. But you better resubscribe because here come the Cardinals of football. Beautiful. All right. I'm going to throw the ball. It's going to get intercepted. No, it will not. That's a good thing. I don't know why I'm saying it like I'm disappointed. But I am disappointed in a way. And he got that. I thought that was going to be intercepted. I think everything's going to be intercepted, but now it is first and goal, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm about to pass to Grunky Jackson. Yes, I am. And we're about to tie this game. Now we've got an eight-level wind, and we still tie it. 7-7 seven, seven with 10 left to go in the first quarter. It took 10 seconds for them to throw a ball. Okay, the Eagles have it in midfield. Okay, touchdown, not good. Hey, they didn't score after that, though. All right, so kickoff and uh, caught the ball. All right, now all I need to do is score a touchdown. And that's always the goal. But not in soccer, because the goal in soccer is a goal. Darn. Oh, and let me know if you guys want me to do Retro Bowl College after this. Like, that would be a pretty interesting topic, Retro Bowl College. Obviously, I don't have comments on, so you can't tell me. But, uh, be sure to subscribe.
if you think we should do Retro Bowl College. Because Retro Bowl College is like this, but it's with college teams. So it's like your origin story if you put the same name in icon. And I dropped the ball. I do think that MLB The Show would be good after this. Like, I could do a road to the show. Interception! Oh, but you're out of bounds! That is insane, that tackle. Dude, just push... Pushes him into the void. Pushes him into the void. Hail Mary. I don't know why we should be hailing Mary. But, uh... Bloody Hail Mary. Alright, so... We are on the 20. And by this point, you guys have realized that I just can't do it in this game. Which is why, if you subscribe right now, you'll give me the power to actually be good. That is a power I have not had in a while. Not since I played my Minecraft videos. Which I will be back to. Oh god, okay. All right. Not great. All right. So Philadelphia is beating us up by the third quarter. And I'm not doing great. All right. Like, I need a, I need to get those, I was going to say runs. Get those points home. Home, which is across the street from Lincoln Pi Financial Park. But you know what would be great? If they had on the Switch, they could do Exhibition. But like Online Retro Bowl. That would be really fun. That would be super fun. Because they don't have Madden, so you can't play Online Madden. They don't have NHL 23. They do have MLB The Show, so you can play Online MLB The Show. They do have FIFA, and they have the ten some random tennis game, but, I mean, tennis isn't that popular, so. No, come on! You gotta be joking. All right, so I throw this guy, interception. If you notice how I don't talk when I pass the ball, it's because I'm so focused in not having it be an interception. Bam, interception. All right, this is not good. They missed the field goal. What are you doing? At home, missing a field goal in one of the best cities to play in. Out of bounds, but I still caught it. Whoa, I, I was not ready for that. Oh, wait. Dude, oh my God. This game is about to be way closer, ladies and gents. Touchdown. G. Jackson. And it's got to be the two-point. My lucky two-point. He's going to catch that, right? Yeah. All right, we are within one single point. I'm going to go for the onside kick, of course. Doesn't make sense, though. To, like, actually. They score the field goal games over unless I can come through in the next 26 seconds of this game. All right, we need a rally. And I want to get tackled. Good. Now, you might be asking why I want to get tackled. So I can just throw to Grunky. And he can just destroy these guys. All right. Stop the clock. Five seconds left. We are so close. A field goal won't make me happy, and neither will Santa. Right now. What? No, I didn't mean to click that. Oh, oh, that was a heartbreaker. I didn't even mean to click the button, and I made it through that giant mess. I got so close. Wow. That's unfortunate, but I guess that means... Game over. All right, so I guess that means, guys, that we lose 19 to 15, and we are back to being in the hunt. We are no longer in the wild card. Continue. Offensive lineman 
Dion Kongbo was on point today. Were you pleased with his performance? Yes. I truly was. All right, team condition is back down to 84%. I will upgrade to Moo. And uh, I'll see you guys in week nine.